And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Days Gone, I'm Verm, and when last we left off we just completed another couple of missions, we did a uh, flashback mission where we went to collect some lavender and then took some up to Boozer and it turned out he'd been alright and been on his feet for a bit. We left without a mission, but when I closed the recording last time we had a recording off Tucker that I'm hoping we'll play again this time, if not I'll explain what it said as we move on, so yeah let's get going. Let's just have a look. Has it added the mission that it gave us? No. No, it has not. So we're going to make our way over towards this ambush camp and hope that the recording plays again. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We got hit. Hit hard. Rippers. A couple of dozen, maybe more. Goddamn rippers. That little gal you were so worried about? Yeah, Lisa. Wait, hold on. What happened? Where's Lisa? Come on. They took her and three others. Alkai followed him as far as he could. But they're holed up at Belknap Crater. He came back to round up more men. But... So, oh, yes, it. Okay, uh, Look, I've seen what those sons of bitches do to hostages. I'm not waiting. We've got to go and collect these people now and save them from these rippers. Um, I do want to check quickly if we have full ammo. Because if not, we could be doing we're going to buy some more. As a word of warning, I'm recording at a different time today, so there's a chance there'll be some noise in the background, but I'll try and edit that out if there is. Also, we are out of ammo, so. So we're going to try and avoid that wolf that's right behind us whilst we go to grab the ammunition. I feel like we are probably about to leave this area of the map as well. So I'm going to try and get that out of the way with. Uh, my driving is typically terrible on this game. But I'm a little distracted, so yeah. I just love the handling of the bike on this. Thanks, brother. Digging up. We're not going to go and collect that just yet. We are instead going to make our way down to uh, Copeland's camp. Grab the ammunition we need, refuel the bike, and then make our way on over to the mission. I like how the two different camps so far have got like completely separate aesthetics, like this has almost got the treehouse type aesthetic, whereas uh, Tucker's is basically your stereotypical work type camp. So we're going to refuel and repair. We used a lot of our money last episode buying new weapons. It's good, thank you. That all you need? Good choice. Last year. And we're back up to full. Come by any time. I'll be seeing you. Hey, Damon. I'll see you around. I really want to go and have another go at that horde that we uh, failed to take out again last time. So that's the mission there. We're going to go and deal with this story mission rather than go and do the camp. The um, ambush camp. I can't remember what it was called for a minute there. Let's just check I'm going in the right direction. I think I am. Yes, it's uh, the tunnels just through this narrow checkpoint, I believe. And here we go. So, Deacon's already very much trying to look after this uh, Lisa. I do get somewhat of a Last of Us vibe from that, but I do kind of get an open world Last of Us vibe anyway from this game. I was describing it yesterday to my friend as like a mixture of The Last of Us and The Walking Dead, which I don't think is an unfair comparison. 
Okay, where are these? Up around the back here. I feel like the audio mix was a little better last episode. Um, I might tweak it again, just to make it a little bit louder, the in-game volume rather. Now, I do remember examining this area behind here when we were here last time, and it is absolutely packed with like caves and stuff. So we're gonna go in here and just try not to get killed, I guess. Oh, and of course it's going to do the transition to night time. Because uh, it did say it was a matter of urgency and yet we can still afford to wait around till night apparently. And we're back on the bike miraculously. Well said, Beak. Okay, we're going to try and do this stealthily, but knowing me, it won't work out that way. <coughs> I'm still not back to 100%, I've got to be honest, folks. I'm going to kill them all anyway. I'm going to kill this guy. I said so. Why don't you find the path? They're a dead asshole. They won't be joining your goddamn cult. Okay, so that guy was being punched and is apparently definitely dead. We didn't rescue him in time. We could be done with a full durability weapon. Let's get a couple of these crafted. All three. Okay. Oh, hello. Well, I said we were going to try and do it stealthily, okay, but we go. it hasn't worked out that way. See, I thought this was a hard spot when I came here previously. They dragged her in here. Like a uh, sacrifice to a horde or something. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't, but it's definitely a fucked up place. Oh. Go over there. Oh no, he's seen me. Oh no. Oh well, he's dead. Rule the world, huh? Not if they're all dead. Completely agree with Deke on this, by the way, folks. Let's kill all these bastards. But I could be doing with some material oh, to make some bandages. Fuck off! <coughs> Try that again. 
I feel like two shotgun shells from there should have killed him though. She's gotta be out here somewhere. Is there anything? Yes, there's plenty of stuff here. Get some of these made. And get a uh, little stinger weapon available. That is what it's called, isn't it? We don't need that. Oh, I've just seen those two. Okay. Can we lure them over there? Yes. Have a blade in your ear, you cunt. You can go over there. Go on. Hang on, Lisa. No matter what they do to you, just, just hang on. We're slowly but surely whittling them down this time, folks. There's Lisa. one here. I'm Two down. here. How are you still alive? You've just took half a clip. Okay, let's uh, deal with these the uh, sensible way. Oh, no. Well, it looks like we're uh, not in any immediate danger anyway. We can just snipe these last ones down. Maybe not. Oh, didn't see you up there. Let's get this reloaded. Should be one more. Is that? Is that the all? I feel like it is. Okay. I was trying to switch uh, shoulders for a while there, but it just wouldn't let me. Are there any ammo supplies up here? I don't think so. Nope. So we're st ah, here we go. I was going to say, so we're stuck with just shotgun ammo, but we're not. I feel like we've just taken out a good chunk of their number, though. Place is a goddamn maze. And that'll obviously come in useful. Any more for any more? This doesn't look good. What's this? A smoke bomb. Up here. They dragged her up here. But why? What's the point? Lisa's has gotta be up there. Did I just see? Something there. No armor. Now. now what? Now oh. Know. 
now I'm fucked, I think is what the now is about. Oh, now they're fucked. I see you. Give me the ammo. Shit. Didn't work out for you, did it? Missed. Well, I guess now's the time to rush him. This has got a very last of his feel to it. Where's that guy? There we go. Last one down by the looks of it. No! Jesus, what? And there's more. Someone else wants some. You want some? Get yeah, ya. Yeah. Where is he? There. Down. Sit down. I think we're alright now, folks. Let's go and see Lisa after we've checked all up here. Give me that medic kit. Dabbing off. And some ammo. And an attractor. Oh no, it was a can. Lisa. Alright, Lisa. Oh Jesus, what have we done to you? Lisa. Lisa? Hey. Sweetheart. No! Hey, hey! No! hey. Shut up, shut up! It's, it's me, it's Deacon. Remember? Deacon? Okay. I can hear uh Either lots of right, normal enemies or lots of uh, freakers. Damn it, can you run? Do you know where the visitor center is? All right, that's where my bike is. I need you to run there as fast as you can. Don't stop. Don't stop. Right, don't stop, no matter what. You ready? Huh? Go. This does not sound good. Come on, man, move. Fucking hell. I don't like escort missions. How can you take a shot to the face and survive? Where's the other one? Not even a stumble from that. Certain things about this game just don't really add up, and that's one of them. Like, it just took a little stubby shot straight to his side. You'd have thought he'd have stumbled at least. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, fuck this. Right, 
Let's craft some more now. Right, let's get moving. The climbing in this game feels very, very awkward. Rippers on the bike. Where you at, fool? Enemy now. Get to my bike. Run. Right, get on, Lisa. We're done here. Fucking hell. The pathing on this game. Are you okay? Pathetic. Listen to me. To the south of here, there's a camp at Lost Lake. It's nothing like the hot springs. Iron Mike, he's not like Mrs. Tucker. I hated Mrs. Tucker. <laughs> no, you wouldn't be alone there. This is a nice camp, and it's a safe place. Okay. Okay, so I think Hot Springs is the third area of this map. So I think we're finally getting to cross over into a new land. Let me just have a look. Uh, no, I think I'm wrong. Or am I? Fuck knows, we'll find out. Let's drive Lisa there then. Ricky. Ricky, come back. Oh no, this is a new character Ricky, that we've uh, introduced, so yes, Lost this is the new camp. area, I think. Deacon? Long time no here. What do you want? Just me, okay? On the Cascade Highway where it intersects with the old Belknap Road. I'm heading there now. You know what Iron Mike said? The night you and Booze rode out of here. Uh, but if he uh, saw yeah. us again, we'd die. Uh, probably. Listen, that's why I radioed you and not Schizo. Iron Mike doesn't even have to know about this. I got a kid here. What? Well, I mean, not a kid. Uh, a survivor. She's been out here a long time. You've got a survivor. And you're bringing her to Lost Lake. No, you're bringing her to Lost Lake. I'm bringing her to you. Ricky, you there? <laughs> yeah, okay. This do not sound good. Lost Lake out. Ricky? Uh, yeah, okay. You're welcome. I just realized that lavender mission we did last time was a you're complete like there, waste kid. of time. It's like I said, Iron Mike, he's, um, uh, he likes to yell a lot. Look, don't let him bother you. You got that? Uh, Sounds anyway, charming. There's this guy named Schizo. If he bothers you at all, well, just tell Ricky. Or uh, tell Addie. She's the camp's doctor. You tell her. And Addie's, she's good. She's got medicine, you know, to clean up the... He's not selling it to her very well, is he? I'm going to shut up for a minute. Hey, Ricky. Hey, Deke. I'm surprised. What, did Tucker give up the slave trade? Uh, Lisa, this is uh, Ricky. She's going to uh, take you to a safe place. Nothing has changed, Deke. Iron Mike is not going to pay you for this. Pay me for? Oh, come on. That's not, excuse me. That's not what this is about. It's not about collecting a bounty or anything. You just, mm -hmm. you just take her. Huh? What's wrong with her, Deke? What's wrong with her? She was, had a run in with some rippers. I had to... Hey, Lisa. Hi, I'm Ricky. Listen, do you like to go fishing? I love fishing. What a fabulous question. In the whole wide world. Would you want to go fishing with me? Yeah? Come on, I'm going to tell you about Lost Lake. It has the clearest water you have ever seen. And the fish, oh my god. The fish in the morning, they jump this high. I'll show you. When we go, we're gonna have such a good time. Make sure you hold on tight, okay? Ready? I really appreciate it. <laughs> Cold shoulder there, Dee. I like Ricky. 
but she's got that compassionate vibe. And that's the end of that mission. Okay. Uh, so we've got two missions to do now. Um, I kind of feel like this one will just be a very quick visit over there. So I'm going to go do that now. And then we'll come back and do this, which feels like the last mission of the area. How are we doing for fuel? Eh. Fine. I feel like this mission uh, with booze is probably going to be the last one of the area. So we'll save that for next time. And then maybe we'll end up having to go to uh, Lost Lake, is it? Simply because we know the Rippers are in the area looking for us. And the name of the mission just makes it sound like something bad's about to happen at the um, little tower we're stationed up in. I've only just noticed the graffiti the top there. Nice touch. Deke, you there? Hot Springs to Deke and St. John. Tucker, I'm here. I expected you back by now. Did you find the girl, Lisa? No, Tucker. The, the uh, Rippers cut her up pretty bad. And she, she didn't make it. Whoa, what happened there? Oh, that's what happened there. Uh, have we got a medic kit? Yes. Y'all are about to die. Uh, get off me. Yeah, fuck off. Side tuck, one less mouth to feed, yeah? You get out there and find me some more bodies, or there won't be any mouths left to feed. Tucker out. I really don't like Tucker. I hope she dies at some point. Uh, my bike is glitched. Bugger. Deke, this is Copeland. How's it going? I've got a job for you. Hmm. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll see if I can, uh, make time. Peeking out. Well, I am going to make my way back to Copeland's camp, I think. Uh, since I'm, by the looks of it, going to have to do it on foot. Unless we can, yes. No, we'll recover the bike further down here. Oh, it's there. It's on the side. I don't know what happened there. So we are going to go and do Sarah's Memorial Stone first, and then we'll clear up the side missions at the start of the next video. Let's see what I can do. I should do it. I don't know why that's there then. Fucking rippers. Let's uh, refuel the bike. Hopefully we don't get smashed off it by somebody. That was relatively painless. Which way? 
straight on. Yeah. Fucking hate roadblocks. I'm kind of excited to see what the new area of the game is. I feel like we've been here for a while now. Be a nice change of scenery. Especially when you consider how completely different this is from uh, the opening area. I forget what they're called now. Starts with a C, I think. Deer crossing. You know, there was a time where that was a bad idea, and you know what? It still is. God, this is a hell of a track. I hope the missions in the new area though do overlap with these two again. As they have in this section of the game. I don't want to forget what each area looks like really. Playing this though is making me want to play both Last of Us games again. Both are of course uh, some of the best games ever made. Just get some of that uh, boost going. Now there is a horde that patrols up here, I remember, so uh, probably got to be careful. Also, I remember seeing a helicopter earlier on. Uh, not in this episode, in a previous episode, and I'm wondering where it went and why Deke didn't try following it. Stay down, you freak of bastard. Come on. Fucking hell. The combat in this game gets kind of intense. Uh, so how do we get up there? This way. And here we are. I'm gonna shut up for a minute. Me again. I know it doesn't make any sense me coming up here since you were never here, but what the hell? Where else am I gonna go? Craziest thing. I found this kid. It, well, oh, okay, she wasn't a kid. She must be 15, 16, something like that. Reminded me a lot of your little sister. Anyway. She had uh, survived all this time on her own in that little town north of Belknap. You know, you remember that one? The little church that we got married in <laughs> because you wanted someplace rustic. So this kid, Lisa, um, I did what I'm paid to do. I brought her in and... I mean, how long was she going to last out there anyway? I took her to the hot springs, and I know, I know you don't like Tucker. But, well, you wouldn't have liked Tucker, I mean, but... I don't like Tucker she either. Tight camp. She keeps her people safe. Only she didn't. The Rippers came, killed some people, took others. They took Lisa. I got her back, but I don't, I don't know. She was messed up before, and I think the Rippers might have gotten into her head. Look, it's not that I give a shit. I don't. She's got to take care of herself like everyone else, right? I guess, I guess I just kept thinking, if it was your little sister, what would you think of me? I should have left her where I found her. Okay, I, uh, I gotta go. 
Boozer's still... Well, I, I don't think that he's getting any better. His arms is pretty messed up, and I don't, I don't think that there's much more that I can do for him. Okay. Bye. And that was that. No one saw it coming next. But then there's also a mission we can do at Copeland's camp. I think I want to do this though. Eh. Uh, yeah, we're gonna drive on over there and then we'll save outside the tower before we're going to do it. In fact, no, change of plan. We're going to drive over to the uh, save point over, if I can open this. Um, we're going to drive on over to, where's the save point? Uh, yeah, we'll drive over to Hot Springs. And then at the start of the next episode, we'll do the ambush camp in the north of this region and then we'll go and do Copeland's mission and then we'll go do the next story mission don't want to be driving off the edge of that cliff And we're nearly there. So yes folks, uh, thank you for watching and I guess next time we're going to go and clear out another ambush camp and do another side mission and fuck me, these cunts are here every time I come in now. And we got another skill point. Fucking hell. Let's uh, get the shotgun reloaded, get the bike, and then go and save. But yeah, as usual, thanks for watching, and as soon as we've fuel the bike up and saved. I'll call it a video. It's deep. Let him in. It is well spotted. I mean I said I don't like Tucker, but I'm happy to still use her camp. Hey, Zanny, keeping your hands clean. Okay then. Yeah, thanks for stopping by. So yes folks, until next time, until then.